Other, other, other pillar that you see over there, you see the uh, it's yeah. 35. The white pillar, you yeah. See so, this is the like same, it? you know, you should. 36 family, and from 36 of this, this pillar. Go all, all the way, the way down. down to the next pillow, right by where the road end, the road ends and starts. Right. Uh -huh. And then go. It goes 80, 80 feet. 80 feet. This is 100. 100 feet down here. Yeah. And so 80 by 100 this way. So what you're looking at, everything we're looking at right there is all your land for plot number 36. Go I wonder why we can do Exactly, because when you're doing these things, and you know, they're, they're just not, you know, that's what you have to have supervisor when you're doing land clearing and all that stuff. Yeah. And so the road, as you can see, you now a nice clear road, because we, we did a nice road clearing, so we can actually see the marking on the road. And so on the other side of 36, you're going to have a Zebo plot 35, which will come, we see the road, which we see the road right here. But this is 35. That goes and it stops by where the, the foundation of the wall is, is. Yeah. and then you see another pillar right there. That one over there. And it's a nice little this four point, and you get 80 by 100. Right. So yes, yeah, so brother Zebo, yes man, that is your plot, and it's That's surveyed right. and everything. That's right. And what kind of home are you gonna build on your your plot? Uh, I'm. Uh, um, I already well, I have a design in mind. Uh, Earthship. Earth it's called an Earthship. Awesome, Earthship. But the only thing I don't want to use is the tires. I want to use uh, organic uh, bricks. Uh, the same type of bricks that, that the uh, rammed earth use, but only it's rammed bricks. And I want to use that organically to build my home instead of using the uh, rubber tires, you know. I, know, I understand Michael Reynolds' uh, idea, but it's just, it's just, I, I just don't want to use anything that's man-made. I want to use all natural material. Absolutely, man, brother. Great idea. And I'm looking at my brother Charles, man. What, what are you going to build? You, you gonna be, he said he's going to build him an earth ship, so you're going to be your spaceship? I want a story building with a rooftop terrace. Yeah, exactly. Same thing I'm looking to build. And yeah. you know, mine is. I don't want a zinc. I don't want that type of aluminum roof. Me, me and all of our plots, the plots you see across here is just, that's a plot for me and my family, yeah. including you and yeah. the rest of my Jamaican crew, mother, father, sister, yeah, I want, I want brother, a child. Terrace. And we're gonna all do some unique design because we're on a nice elevation. Because yeah. two story will give us a nice view of the town. That's what I want. That's I don't right. want a house like that. So you want, you want solid uh, concrete brick? No, no, I want the earth ram. The ram earth home. Ram earth, but yes. he want a different Yeah, I want design. a story building yeah. so with a rooftop tower. He want a two floor. Right. He yeah. wants to be up in elevation. Yeah. Right. Because I think the thing so when, I'll make, when you're looking I'll at you, you get more, well, yeah, because you get more, you get more land space yeah. if you so build up. Plant. And then if you build a rooftop terrace, so then you can actually just have more access to more more living space right. or social space. Well, you're going up, you're going higher. You're going up. Yeah, plus, I need, plus, I want my solar panels to be uh, ground deployed, not roof, because I can maintain them. When they're on the roof, it's difficult to see if they're cracked or they're dirty. I want a ground base so I can have all my panels on the ground. That's so a great I idea. clean them every week right. with water, with a hose, yeah. and I could check for faults. Yeah, when they're on the roof, it's too much trouble. Right. You have to I don't like heights neither. They're on the yeah. ground. I can I can yeah. service them myself. Right. right. I can wash them every week with a broom. Check for cracks. Check for any you know ch chafing right. in the wiring. Right. Right. But when they're on the roof, it's another story. You have right. to get the professionals to come in. I ain't right. going up on no freaking roof like that. Right. Fall Street. off and break my neck. Street. For what? Straight. Yeah, good good, good, good point, ground. brother. Good point, brother. And family, you're looking at two of our brothers, and I mean, and they're talking about billing their home, their future home, their dream home, right here at Black South Pan African want, Community. Some of the first things I want to build, uh, plant, is like mango. You know, we always got to do that mango. It's a uh, mango, some coconut, some, coconut, some guava, want, well, some want, orange want, tree. I want even breadfruit. Even orange, if I have to go to Jamaica and get the mangoes, seeds. Orange. I All that good stuff, fruit. man. Sweet sap, sour sap. Aki's already Aki. here. Aki. Yeah. But you still have to plant here. everything on the property because yeah. right. I'm sure that the trees papaya. there are some pa value. Papaya, definitely. Papaya. papaya. Yeah. Sour yeah. sops. Sour and you're going to plant some, uh, some pineapples. Yeah. Tamarind. <laughs> yeah. You're talking about building an organic lifestyle. Yeah, and then yeah. on the rooftop terrace, organic. you can't put that on tape now. This is yeah. organic <laughs> living. This is, this is organic the, living. The rooftop yes. terrace, we can't say what's going to go on up there. This is the next stage oh, of Absolutely, the earth, it's a social place. Earth. Oh. 
are away with all the chemical. The mm. old earth is dying out. Mm. The new earth is coming into being, yeah. which is all natural, yeah. no chemicals, and I want, all natural. And I want lime and lemon trees in my yard right. too. Lime, that's lemon, right. You want a food lime. forest. Yes. Exactly, and that's what I'm saying, that uh, everything lime, we have to do has got to be sustainable yeah. to the highest yes. level. That's and right. that means we have to grow things, so it's perfect here. Because we, we don't have a situation where a developer is going to tell us that everything has to be concrete right. and they're going to cut down the grass and cut down the trees because you don't want no snakes around. Right. You have to be able to find a way to live with the nature. Other than that, you're going to... Yeah. I mean, look what they did to New York City. They only have one place of greenery called Central Park. Well, we can bring some mongoose in from Jamaica. They eat snakes now. Yeah. <laughs> the so next I'm thing you know, the mongoose eat the snake and now you have a mongoose problem. I don't mind the mongoose. The mongoose ain't gonna bite me. <laughs> yes, they'll bite the snake though. Huh? They'll eat the yeah. snake. Yeah. Absolutely, brother. So, uh, any I don't final like words, idea. brother? No mamba's running around loose now. Well, you know, uh, one good thing about whatever you build in nature, you know, you can contain and work it out. So that's what we're gonna do because we right. don't want to destroy nature. That's right. Yeah. So, yes. brothers, any final words? Uh, uh, plot number 35 and plot number 36. Uh, to just uh, get go the, down to Echo Bank and get me a loan. Contract. <laughs> get the surveyor to get out of here uh -huh. so that he can survey my uh, my land so I can break ground. I yeah, the survey uh, that survey should be completed. You just need to give it to you. Right. So we just need to get it from the lands commission. So that's the issue that we have. We just need to get our survey to go to the lands commission, pick up all of the surveys completed, and then get started on the surveys that we have for, for new people who want right. to get this pl exactly. plan so are uh, they going. Back, are they heading back to the bus? Yes. Uh, all right, hold on. Yes, they've had enough. So, family, uh, yeah, you guys are good. Uh, appreciate it. Uh, appreciate these brothers uh, committing and uh, you know, yes. dedicating themselves to these uh, plot because that's how we're able to pay for the land. We all, you know, acquired a plot and we put our money down. That basically means we put our money together. And that's how we paid for it. You know, that's 50 right. plots, 50 people, the land is paid for. Yeah. Right. And all we need to do is build. So, family is that simple in black economics. More people yeah, will be joining yeah, us. Yeah, you know. family. Yeah, right. you know, we're, we're we are the here. Main guy. You know, we're that's the, why we have a word. Mm -hmm. We have a, uh, our lang our local language called Sankofa. So that's why we need we, need, we want you guys to come here. The we blacks, we want to come here to come back in your that's motherland. Right. That's so right, brother. So this when you are coming, it's like we are coming to Sankofa. We are coming to take it again. That's this right. is your that's land. Right. So come and take your that's land right. and build your home, build your house, and feel like home. To so come and come with Brother Bomani, That's Africa right. for the African, journey right. for your lifetime. Yes, brother, appreciate it, man. We keep it strong. That's right. That's right, brother. We